Black News Network. Oh my gosh, the the Meg the Stallion versus uh basically the state versus Tory Lanez has just blown up. The case is going completely haywire. It starts with the witness Kelsey. Kelsey gets on the stand today, asked for a granted, asked for a full immunity, and it was granted. That means under most laws, most state laws, that at that point. The witness must get on the stand and answer questions asked. They can no longer plead the fifth on any criminal um, activity. So when you get on the stand and they ask you a specific question, if it will lead to a criminal indictment, you must plead the fifth. However, if you plead and ask for a full immunity, it means that you must answer that damn question. And... Kelsey is not answering that question, leaving a lot of doubts. I'm, I'm sure the jury is wondering what is what, but I do know something. If Meg, the victim, has been shot. If they have given immunity to this person and then Kelsey takes the rap for Tory. And by the way, Tory has been alleged to have tried to buy these women off, whether it's Meg or Kelsey. If, May, if Kelsey has taken that money and is now going to take the rap for this, that means he can walk free and she may not um, be prosecuted because she's given full immunity. Now, that full immunity can go up in effing smoke. Why? Because it was based on the statements that the person had prior. That person would then have perjured themselves and then the trial could be against Kelsey. So it is it is a complete and utter mess right now. It is getting sorted out. It's going to be more tomorrow. But this is a major break in in the uh, Tory Lanez, Megan Thee Stallion case. It it's not it's not clear for whatever is next. That's what I will say. We all know Meg got shot in the foot. That that has been established. There have been text messages that that contradict what Kelsey is going to be saying or could possibly be saying. It's a major, major deal right now. It's a blockage. Oh, and let me tell you one more thing. One more thing. Kelsey is campaigning for contempt of court. That is no doubt about that. Once you have immunity in place, the general synopsis, the general thing is you must answer the prosecutor's questions or the defense questions or the judge's questions without hesitation. If she continues to refuse to answer, look it up. She could be placed in contempt of court and the judge can wait until and this this matter get continued until a person decides they want to testify. That can possibly happen or be sentenced to whatever the, the days are and then the, the trial concludes while she's in prison or in jail, excuse me. So that is a major thing going on right now. Just letting you know we're monitoring in here. At the Black News Network, please tap in with us. Please continue. This is crazy.